Sean Sewell, Riley and Chloe Sewell, and this is the Patagonia Das Parka, Dead Air Space Parka. This is a bonkers synthetic insulation jacket, and I'm going to tell you a lot of reasons of why I love it so much, and what it's made of, and why it's bonkers. So let's get into it. Dead Air Space. So Patagonia teamed up with um, Primaloft to create this new synthetic insulation featuring Aerogel. Now, Aerogel you might have heard of, it's a NASA technology, it's basically like 99.9% .9 air, and so you trap that dead air space for insulation. Really great stuff. So they found a way to make it into a, you know, a puffy insulation that's pliable, and then they added in uh, Primaloft Gold Echo as well. So you get 133 grams of Primaloft Gold Echo with 40 grams of that crazy cross-core aerogel super duper insulation for a total of like 173 grams of insulation. That's bonkers. That's legit. So um, I like to keep a really, really significantly warm jacket, whether it's down um, or synthetic in my winter kit. So this is going to my splitboarding kit uh, for, from here on out. <laughs> So, um, and this is why. So, obviously you have a substantial amount of really good insulation. It's synthetic, so I don't have to worry about wetting out. It packs up actually pretty small for being synthetic. That's often the, the bane of synthetic insulation is it's really big and puffy. Um, and as you can tell, it is puffy, but I'll show you a picture in a minute of it packed up. And it actually will fit in your, I have a 40 liter kit is what I carry. And if it's in there, no problem. If you're a climber, this would probably be a particular interest to you because this would be a fantastic ballet jacket. Because of course you have your two-way zippers, obviously very important for you climbers. Now I'm not a climber, so I'm not going to go into too much more details because I can't speak to it authentically. But I'm a mountain man, winter camper, and a split water, and I'll go into those details of why this jacket is really great. So you get that substantial amount of legitimate, awesome insulation. None of this three or four ounces, you know, stuff. We're talking, you know, twice that, which is what you want if you want to stay safe, especially in a worst case situation. Or maybe best case, you're having lunch on top of a mountain on the Alpine and you want to stay nice and toasty. So you can stay comfortable and happy. Great choice, this jacket here, the Das Parka. Now, it features ultralight materials. Pertex Quantum Pro with a PU coating. This guy right here, 10 denier too. 10 denier, that's... That's bonkers as well. A lot of bonkers today. 10 denier Pertex Quantum Pro on the outside, 10 denier Pertex Quantum on the inside. So obviously very, very, very lightweight materials. This extra large comes in at 20 ounces. That's right, this is extra large for reference. I'm six foot one, 205, 45 inch chest, 33 inch waist, 36, 37 on the arms. As you can tell, it's a freaking perfect fit. Now I did size up to extra large, even though I could probably fit into a large, reason being, this is my outermost layer for the coldest of activities. So it layers nicely over mid-layer and t-shirt. But for the purposes of this test, I was really trying to push this thermal efficiency of this jacket and really test it out. So I only used a t-shirt for the entire testing process, which I would not recommend doing, and you probably won't be doing that in real life anyways. I really wanted to see how warm this jacket really was. So, uh, the last week we were down in the sand dunes here in Colorado. And if you know anything about deserts, they can get cold at night. So we got down to 18, 20 degrees. The week before that, we were in Grand Lake, Colorado, right on the lake. And of course, 4 a.m. walking the dogs, temps right around 20, 22 degrees. Just a t-shirt on and this, totally fine. So in your real world use of this, you'll probably have this over other layers. Uh, so it's a warm jacket. It's a very, very warm jacket. Um, up there with any down parka it's a very very warm check and um like i mentioned 133 grams plus 40 grams of that crazy insulation in here and it's mapped out very nicely pocket wise we have two sizable hand pockets with actually very nice big zippers i like how big they are and bright they are and easy to access with gloves on and then you have a nice chest pocket right here and if you're curious yes it will heat up your large iphone like it was a snack with room to spare or more importantly, you probably keep a beanie and gloves in here. Easy access. The the sleeves are really great. They're obviously they're accurate in length. They also feature a little loop right there. Always nice and handy. No pun intended. There is elastic. It's great because the elastic is not on the end. The elastic is actually right about here, an inch 
or maybe a couple centimeters in right there. So it creates a nice seal right here. And if you had gloves on, which I will any minute now because it's starting to get cold, it makes it a nice, great seal. The hood, sizable, elastic, adjustable. Oh, it's warm and cozy. I don't want to take the hood off. <laughs> the sun's about to set in about 15 minutes and the temperatures are dropping. And this squirrel's telling me to wrap it up. All right, on the inside, we get two sizable drop pockets. If you know me, you know I love drop pockets for a lot of reasons. And here's a really cool feature I have not seen in many of jackets before. It's elastic airy mesh right here. Now this is fantastic if you're gonna put something in here like, you know, maybe some wet gloves or mittens or something you just wanna air out, de-stinkify it, or hopefully circulate some air in there and dry. Um, that's a pretty cool little feature. It's elastic and it's, you know, it's a drop pocket. I love drop pockets. So MSRP is uh, 450 for this jacket. This is a Patagonia Das Parka, Dead Airspace Parka. And uh, you might have, I had a lot of people ask me about this jacket over the last year because at the outdoor retailer, the last outdoor retailer in person show, hanging out with Corey from Patagonia, going through the lineup, and the, this jacket really caught my attention. And so we followed through with Corey and he hooked us up with this. And um, loving it. So thank you, Corey. Thank you, Patagonia. Thank you, Coley. This is a great jacket. It's going to see a lot of use this winter for winter camping with our beautiful dogs that are somewhere in the mountains. Hopefully not too far away. There's Chloe. I see her. And lost split party missions. So, uh, fantastic kit. If you're looking for a legitimately warm, awesome, durable, well-made, fair trade sewn jacket, then look into the Patagonia Das Parka. Uh, links below where to purchase. My name is Sean Sewell, owner and director of Stoke for Ingimit.com. Hopefully you found this helpful. If you have any questions, I'll do my best to answer on YouTube below or on the website at uh, If you like this, hopefully you hopefully did. Subscribe. Um, shoot me an email, sean at with any questions. And uh, until next time, take care.